the concept of affordable housing has until now fallen in the range of 200 million shillings plus for a house. But exploiting the condominium law, developers can now sell off houses from as low as 47 million shillings. The condominium law made it possible in Uganda now to buy a house like a flat, right? And you get a title, right? Before you needed to buy the actual ground, right? But now you can get a title on the second floor or the third floor. That's the whole idea of condominium. You sign up an agreement and then you're supposed to pay a minimal fee which will cover... Um, rubbish. Yeah, uh, utilities like uh, rubbish collection, uh, general security, and ensure that you live harmoniously as a community. Because what it really entails is buying an apartment on a flat. And mortgage provider housing finance is partnering with Comfort Homes to provide homes for less than 50 million shillings. As a bank, we don't build and we cannot build. But uh, as the largest provider of mortgages, it's in our direct interest that the supply of affordable homes on the market uh, continues to grow. Only then can the mortgage market uh, grow significantly because then uh, the demand uh, will meet the supply uh, in terms of the price, uh, the locations, um, the design. We provide affordable quality products and we are very flexible as far as the payment plans are concerned. To increase our, our payment options, we are here today to sign an MOU with Housing Finance Bank so that they can help us attain our goal as far as the customers are concerned. As you can imagine, these low-cost houses under condominium law are selling like hotcakes, currently almost sold out in the Naria and Gayaza estates. Samo Setumba, NTV, Business.